fly through this stuff because there's a lot here and I just want to kind of show it off so I can get it filed away so a um, couple Halloween titles I picked up I'm gonna be watching over the next few days first up we got the we got the legend of Halloween Jack right here and then I also got the sequel the curse of Halloween Jack so I don't know they're probably not gonna be great but what the hell um, also I picked up Nightmare Castle now I've already I've had the curse one and two double feature from Scream Factory 
but I've always been on the lookout for Curse 3. So, Christopher Lee. So, grab that. And then, I actually picked up two copies. Whoops. Two copies of Bats Human Harvest, which one of them is from my buddy Lewis Switcher. We both ended up wanting to get this title, and I was lucky enough to find two the other day. So, one of these will be going to him. And this is, of course, the sequel to the original Bats. Now, this DVD is actually pretty rare. Um, I've only ever seen it one time, and I bought it. If you look for it online, it's pretty pricey. And that's The Taking of Deborah Logan. Uh, Criterion I picked up. I've been very curious about this movie for quite a few years. Um, I've looked at the DVD at Half Price Books many times, never picked it up, but now it's out on Blu-ray, so decided to finally check this one out. Another good one for Halloween here, The Dark Tapes. Don't know nothing about this. This one I just picked up yesterday, Spooked. It is uh, the Ghosts of Waverly Hills Sanitarium. Uh, I know this was on the Sci-Fi Channel, just because it says so right there. I guess it was some kind of documentary special about Waverly Hills, so this will be perfect to watch this time of year as well. This one, I've only actually ever, ever had this on VHS, but I've also never seen an old school DVD snapper case that is a lenticular cover. So, and this was only a couple dollars, so I got Ghost Ship with this cool lenticular cover. And like I say, it's an old school snapper case, so. Another one I did not need to buy because I already have, you know, both Arrow releases of Killer Clowns with both slip covers on them. But this one here, as soon as I saw that it's a lenticular as well, I had to get it. See that? You just got the unpopped popcorn kernels, and then boom, there they're popped with the clowns. Really cool. Yeah, no question about this. I had to grab that. Um, interesting story about this next one. So, I don't know if anybody remembers this movie from a couple years ago a Christmas horror story um, so Walmart would not release this in their store with the word Christmas so they had to make a special slipcover and change the word Christmas to holiday so you know when you bought it you know a holiday horror story but it's still the original title underneath just because they didn't want the word Christmas that was a couple years ago well they actually did it again with this title you know I mean just looking at the cover you can probably guess the word that they left out that they didn't want to show so underneath you got the original title which is satanic panic and like I say they didn't want that word satanic so they had to get that slip cover made and change the title to panic just I mean I may not like the movie but it's just a cool unique thing that they you know have done that a few times laser discs um, I got three laser discs all Sylvester Stallone movies first up I got the laser disc for Rambo 3 look at that so freaking cool next up we got cliffhanger this is one I just picked up yesterday as well and then this one now I actually have the Anchor Bay DVD of this movie never watched it just bought it because of Stallone but it's just kind of weird that you know he did a movie with Dolly Parton so there you go Stallone and Dolly Parton and Rhinestone there'll be more coming so that's it for now guys I'll see you guys later